Hey guys, it's Megan, and today I'm sharing some easy farmhouse style Halloween decoration ideas, so let's get started. I made this DIY uh, for fall, and I shared that in one of my fall DIY videos. I will have that video linked down below in case you're interested in it, but I just wanted to take it and, you know, make it a little bit more like Halloween-y. So I took some spider webs and just wrapped some spider webs around it, and then I decided I wanted to add some creepy crawlers. So I had these on hand that obviously are bright colored, so I decided to just spray paint them black. So they they would fit more of like the creepy look obviously so again I just spray painted them black and this is so easy you can get these at Dollar Tree and lots of other places super inexpensive and then just spray paint them whatever color you want then I took this snake and I added it inside this and I just played around with it and added some spiders I didn't want to take the spider webs up too high um, since it is a candle and I do light it some um, you know I didn't want to risk it catching fire but I love the way that it turned out just adding some little creepy crawlers to it and some spider webs I think it looks cool and spooky and farmhousey for Halloween so I'm really happy with how it turned out Next, I just took this glass from Dollar Tree. It looks super farmhouse to me. I added some water to it and just took one of Dollar Tree's black roses, just the stem, and I think it looks super Halloween-y and cool and farmhouse-y. I added some greenery. You totally don't have to, but I just love this farmhouse-style Halloween decor. Next, I saw this at Dollar Tree and I immediately thought farmhouse and I wasn't sure what I wanted to do with it and then it hit me. So I took some moss from Dollar Tree and then I just filled it in there and I took some of those little skeleton heads. They come eight in a pack. I love them. You could also spray paint them and stuff too, but I thought just the way that they came looked like perfect and farmhousey and creepy for me. So I just added those in there and added some more moss in there. Then I took one of these little creepy crawlers like rats and added that in just for the extra spooky effect obviously you don't have to do that if you don't like that extra bit of you know creepiness but I think these two look so good paired together I really think it gives that Halloween feel but staying in that farmhouse vibe Next, I just took this wreath. I already had it on hand from Dollar Tree, which is why I was spray painted gold. I used it for something else, but obviously you could spray paint it any color you wanted to or just leave it. And then I took this scarf from Dollar Tree that's like a little Halloween scarf, and I just took each side. I kind of did it down the middle and twisted one one way and the other the other way and then left some hanging and then tied a little knot. I just wanted it really simple, and to me, it's very farmhouse looking, and you could obviously add stuff to it and you know put some greenery in it but i just kept mine nice and simple like this these last two diys are so easy i do this all the time with different things from dollar tree but i just took that frame that i already had on hand but you know dollar tree sells frames too and then this halloween card that i loved the image of it and i knew i wanted to use it in my halloween decor so of course i wanted to spookify mine up a little bit more since we like to do creepy halloween stuff so i added some you know fake spider webs to it and played around with that spider webs are like my just like of me when it comes to decorating i find them so difficult to use but they add such a creepy effect so i still use them and then of course i added some little spiders on it and i did the same thing with this image i accidentally cut the top off a little bit but you know it's fine it still worked for me again that um, frame i already had on hand but you could get a frame from dollar tree and then just added some more spider webs to it and some spiders and i think that these two um, cards look so good paired together i hope you guys enjoyed these diys give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you haven't already i have more halloween diys coming and some halloween decorating videos so stay tuned for that they will be super soon and thank you all so much for watching i hope you have an amazing rest of your day and i will see you in my next video bye